हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू आर न्यू वीडियो टुडे वी हैव विद अस अ 2023 पास आउट बैच स्टूडेंट दैट इज प्रतीक पाटिल वेलकम प्रतीक टू टैलेंट बैटल ही हैज जस्ट बीन सिलेक्टेड विद जियो कंपनी एट द पैकेज ऑफ 5 एलपीए सो अ बिग कांग्रेचुलेशंस फ्रॉम आवर साइड थैंक यू सो मच सर थैंक यू okay pratik first of all how are you feeling being such a uh, at a younger stage just placements has been started in the colleges and you have been placed with such a big package and a big company so how are you feeling so uh, that's that's uh, all uh, fresher students have uh, dream to get and uh, any job in uh, in mnc or startup so i think i'm feeling very good sir because i have got two offers great so you have two offers in hand yes sir okay great so moving ahead pratik today uh, you are with us to share your valuable experience that you uh, felt through the hiring process of jio so maybe you could help your uh, younger batch that is just coming up or the same batch your co batch 2023 pass out to uh, those who are planning to uh, enter in jio they can get a slight overview to your question okay yes sir yes definitely so shall we start yes sir sure okay so pratik first question is was it an on campus or or off campus drive yeah sir both the drives are on campus sir okay so for now uh, first of all we'll be talking on the geo okay yes sir so uh, geo was an off campus on campus drive yes sir, on campus yeah. okay and now how was your hiring process carried on it was online or offline Sir, offline, sir, totally offline. But okay. the assessment test is online in my college lab. But it, we can say it offline. Okay, uh, that means it was just a computer-based assessment, right? Yeah, yeah, under the guidance of GOT. Okay, so starting with Pratik, uh, first question is, like, first, uh, how was the uh, like the registration process basically? Was there any? What was so, the eligibility criteria? How you were shortlisted for sitting in this company? tell us something about that so, yes sir uh, all the average companies uh, have that uh, eligibility criteria that 60% above no backlog prior backlog or etiquette or something or we have uh, just all the all the uh, curricular activities above the 60% so that's all average criteria uh, or average criteria that uh, you also have sir okay 60% throughout was the criteria yes sir yes sir. okay so what was the first round that was taken by jio so the first round is uh, assessment test sir, which is offline held in our college okay so how what were the modules of the test uh, how many sections was there so uh, test has 1 hour 45 minutes and there is a uh, there is a sections like uh, quants uh, means all the aptitude uh, sections uh, quants logical reasoning and there is also sql based question also pseudo code also and uh, there is total 26 questions in assessment test the 24 questions are totally mcq and 50, uh, 25 number and 26 number is a uh, coding round coding question hands on coding question yeah yeah okay and uh, what was the eligibility criteria in this test like uh, was it was mentioned like you have to gain such a percentage or pass this the test with some basic criteria was mentioned or not no 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 because uh, that's all the uh, all the access or all the control has jio team only because how many students are uh, sitting for that assessment and compared to that number how many are uh, going for that next round they are uh, only controlled by jio team okay but it was a elimination round right yeah yeah elimination round okay and uh, the same uh, the question on the same module is like what was the questions like do you remember any questions that was or it was a general aptitude questions no 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 uh, talking about a general aptitude question yeah that is a general aptitude questions but talking about uh, another section means uh, there is a mix questions sql slightly uh, os based questions in sql section if there is a uh, query uh, written by them we are just need to how what the output of that sql query that is the four options in mcq we need just to pick up that uh, options and just uh, go through for next question okay as you mentioned there was 24 questions and uh, two questions were from the coding part so that 24 yes. questions all the questions were mcq type 
yes 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 total mcq type and what according to you was the difficulty criteria it was difficult or it was uh, moderate level moderate level sir totally moderate okay and what was the ratio of students that cleared the first round from your college uh 70 percent uh, students are selected in assessment one okay so then we can say it was a moderate level test right yeah yeah and talking level. upon uh, coming on the uh, coding part uh, do you remember yes. the questions or the topics on which the coding questions were there yes yes uh, there is one is e uh, easy level question and one another one is moderate level means we can say it as intermediate uh, coding we need to require for that questions one is about uh, means just permutation and combination type questions and okay. one uh, one next one next one is uh, graph like questions so there is uh, vary from student to student every student uh, got uh, means uh, different questions based on which set uh, they got for that assessment okay okay so that was all the coding questions uh, but now coming to some aptitude topics any topics or any uh, like what was the mostly most frequently asked questions in the test so most frequently asked questions talking about there is a triangle based questions that how many triangles in that figure or talking about another section is uh, what is the percentage of these or how the uh, average or ratio can be calculated all the typical aptitude moderate questions will be asked in any okay. chapter uh have you taken uh, like uh, the questions uh, you thought have you solved them earlier were there questions uh, from that which uh, yes. which you have been solving through your preparation yes 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 uh, as i uh, told i have, have uh, i have taken that master class and i have from batch 7 in tiger battle and i okay. practice percentage uh, ratio and proportion or uh, age and uh, time and distance time and work questions from our a talent better class so that quite helped me to solve this question also great great so moving ahead pratik when did you got your results for the first online assessment and uh, after that which was the second round so uh, after the completion of test next in after the 2 hours i got that result that uh, which they don't all selected or rejected okay on the same day you got the results and on the same day there was a yes. second round yeah so uh, geo drive is coming our college for only two days and okay. that two days they are uh, going to select all the final students okay then what was the second round uh, second round is uh, based based on assessment uh, test score so if a student got a uh, highest marks take go through direct year one interview means uh, uh, technical first interview and the okay. student who got less marks than uh, that students they go to direct uh gd means group discussion group. okay they have to pass through gd section yeah okay so in which category did you like so i go through gd okay. i don't have that much score in because uh, in my coding sections only uh, out of 10 they all there is only four test is passed so there is partially accepted submissions okay no issues then uh, afterwards like you said it was a gd section so how was the gd yeah. carried out uh, what was the duration of the gd and what was the topic okay so uh, for gd there is a sets for the students of 10 uh, 10 10 students so my set is last so okay. i have got a, a topic name for gd is change only change. one keyword change okay yeah. and there is a hr ma'am and one uh, team member also from geo they are just looking or observe uh, who students can perform well or not so they are uh, giving us 1 minute to think about that topic and 5 minute to talk about okay. so every student can contribute in that uh, topic and uh, after the 5 minute uh, 5 minute of completions they are just uh, uh, go through that uh, how students can uh, perform in gd and reset will be declared in after one hour okay so did you initiated or someone else initiated the topic yes 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 i initiated in uh, second uh, second position okay. and i just uh, go through all the uh, notebook and pen to going for notes in that one minute while i while i'm thinking about that topic so i think that means i uh, the approach of their observation quite be changed or you can uniquely define from other students also 
so okay. that's my plus point and uh, after that i would like to initiate and i would uh, mention all the important topic only not all that uh, topic which i generally talk about about change that change is important in life no there is change is going for a revolution uh, we need uh, that that stuff okay nice so moving ahead uh, now uh, to the third round what was it uh, yes it was the l1 interview technical one yes yes technical uh, one interview okay so after the after the uh, result of that gd only two to uh, three students um, selected from each set of that gd okay. and uh, i am one of them after uh, from my uh, set so i am going for a next uh, l1 interview and that was also on same day and okay. uh, that is uh, yeah in our college so Uh, that duration of that interview is totally uh, 10 to 15 minutes only okay not that so, not that much okay now moving to the questions so you must be remembering the technical interview questions so please start yes, one yes, by sir. one so how did it all went okay, okay. yes prateek okay. so talking about my uh, technical interview Uh, when i uh, just uh, going for that face to face physical interview that is my, my first interview in my life which is i am uh, going to uh, just go, go through that hr round and uh, you know, going for that technical round so there is a ma'am who is uh, you know, asking me first question is uh, tell me about yourself so i just prepare for that uh, questions and i just go through that answer so after uh, while i am talking that answer uh, she just uh, listening properly that why what i am talking about my about my uh, about my self questions and uh, she pick up that keywords from my uh, about myself and just ask me next question on that only so i prepared in uh, that scenario that i just comfortable with okay right? i just talk uh, talk to her like uh, i am good at sql cpp and various technologies which helps me in my personal and academic projects as well so i am talking about my one of the projects and i just uh, they they told her that i'm uh, i think that my strength to be a team team up here so i just go through all that uh, scenario and after that uh, question is uh, completed she asked me that okay you are good at sql then tell me what is foreign key so i go through that uh, foreign key syntax and all the uh, real world example then she asked me what is difference between primary key and foreign key and next question is uh, how the truncate and uh, delete command is different from each other and then she uh, asked me about what is abstraction so why talking about uh, that questions what is abstraction she just uh, she just uh, thinking that he uh, he would uh, or he can say just only one word that abstraction is a data id no but i am just preparing uh, in that way that i am go to uh, in uh, this scenario that abstraction is a op concept and then we can just go through that flow that real world example then technical example and what abstraction work and how the abstraction uh, can work in any scenario so i'm go through that scene and then i will go to that uh, particular code so just uh, that is quite quite a long answer but it is satisfied so she just say okay okay it is you know and my interview was just finished for everyone in okay so we can uh, say that the most questions were from the sql part right yeah the because the i DBMS just mentioned part. in my about myself yes you yeah, mentioned yeah i just that. mentioned because yeah i need to uh, i need to just ask from them only the question from my comfortable zone not uh, anything so i just prepare my about myself in that scenario so my uh, interview flow that uh, going to, uh, going that way great so what was the next round then then uh, after that uh, after that uh, interview completion i uh, next day that next uh, next round will be uh, going on and the result of that uh, l1 interview will be on that same day at night 10 pm okay so only the only the uh, few student means 16 student only uh, selected from our college for that l1 interview and and that uh, 16 student will be uh, go for that next l2 interview which is held in our same college but in uh, different location of okay. total of okay so what was that l2 interview was it technical or hr uh, it is mixed quite mixed 
okay because uh, there is lots of students from all the colleges with who are uh, going for that ELT interview and our college is one of them so when i go uh, go through that uh, interview uh, that uh, hr ma'am asked me about uh, tell me about yourself that all the average questions and just then she asked me that uh, what is your hobbies and i just uh, told him that i have a youtube channel and i create and edit videos which makes me creative and makes my thought process logical so i prepared this answer in that scenario that she likes my hobby which is uh, work in the in her mind that he, okay he, he can uh, contribute to our company yes, so yes, she yes. asked me okay do, do you have a youtube channel then show me you know how many uh, subscriber do you have what kind what type of content you are uh, making and okay what uh, what uh, softwares were used to edit that video uh, tell me about your family uh, your, what your fathers do and that stuff and then she asked me on the two technical questions one of is how to allocate a memory in c and cpp and next question is what is plugin key and when i just uh, told uh, her that plugin key is this and the, uh, all the syntaxes like this so she uh, okay with that and she okay i'm done with this Okay, now that yes, check interview is finished in just ten or uh, fifteen minutes. Okay. So we can say mostly questions were from HR only, only just few questions. HR one, yeah, yes, yes, yes. Just, that was just also related to your hobbies. Yeah, uh, because I am just uh, prepared my about myself in that scenario that I have hobbies also, I have technical skills also, and I have learned all the technologies which you want to uh, just uh, predict from us also. Okay, so was that the last uh, round, or uh, after that there was some another rounds as well? No, no, that was the last round for base package. Geo okay. comes for three packages: IU, six, and seven. Okay. So this process is uh, is uh, completed for base package. And from my college, sixteen students appear for year two interview, and from that sixteen student, only fourteen students can just pass that year two interview. Okay, and that fourteen students will be selected for base package for your LPA, and still okay. process is going on for six and seven LPA. So, what uh, what is the like uh, the process that is going on? Uh, like uh, there is uh, two interviews uh, pending. Okay, one one for six LPA. Who uh, that uh, students who can pass Did that? You hear that they are okay. selected for yeah 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 they are selected for six, and the uh, next one is seven. I know the who that uh, pass that interview they are also selected in seven. Okay, so our best wishes from our side that you clear both the interviews and go with the highest package only. But for uh, yet we can say that we are uh, very happy to fe- uh, to hear that you have been selected at five LP also. Because uh, when we say that uh, come to when we come to any IT company, the growth is always there. So we must yes. go with the brand, uh, not with the package, because it's the starting of your career, right? Yes, but we hope that uh, you achieve the highest package. Yes, sir, definitely. Sir. Okay, so we would like to hear once again from you, Pratik, that you have cracked the highest package as well. Okay. Yes. Sir. So moving ahead, Pratik, uh, any other suggestions or any preparation plans, any strategies you want to share with your uh, fellow beings, those who are uh, just preparing for this company? Yes, sir, sure, sir. I was uh, just. I would like to add something is, there is any company, any package from three uh, fifty. I mean, three point five LP also or nine LP also. They just want from you is how the OOPs concept and how the SQL do you have prepared from your side, because they don't need any uh, major technology that you want uh, that you have that knowledge also. No, because they just ask you the. Few basic questions in a tricky way. They just uh, they just try to uh, try to just get that how you are prepare yourself in basic scenario. They are going to train you when you are going to see it from that side. But they just ask you what you are going to uh, how you are going to prepare your side from SQL and basic OOPs. So I think that you need to prepare in that scenario that OOPs concept you can anytime you can uh, tell about OOPs concept. Not like this. That abstraction is a data item. No, you need to add the code, real world example, technical example, and how data abstraction is different from encapsulation. Because only few students can know encapsulation. Also, just perform data abstraction. But encapsulation is wrapping up a data and also performs the data hiding and the abstraction perform 
hiding of a implementation of a code so that basic answers we can they just uh, they just want from our side two student can uh, two uh, two student can uh, uh, take same answer but how you can uniquely just uh, show your side from that student that the matters in any interview technical okay. assessment always always a uh, uh, tough than interview but interview can always easier than uh, technical because you you just uh, you just tell about yourself in that scenario that interview goes on your side also yes of course uniqueness is always important while answering the question yes 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 yes, yes. great prateek so thanks prateek for being here today with us and guiding uh, your fellow being so and uh, sharing your valuable experience with us we are very happy uh, and we feel proud that 2023 batch students have been started uh, getting placed in such big mncs so best of luck from our side prateek for your career and for your thanks. future so thanks prateek thank uh, any else anything else you want to mention at the end no i just want to thank you for uh, giving me an opportunity to just express my interview experience from your platform and uh, bas thank you so much <laughs> thanks prateek uh, have a nice day uh, we wish to meet you once again uh, with your second company in which you have been placed yes. in so yes. thanks prateek have a nice day thank you so much